Greetings fitness enthusiasts! Welcome aboard our fitness journey, where we decode the secrets of muscle building. Your support means the world to us, so if you're excited about your fitness journey, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. It's you who makes this channel grow and helps us bring you more content. We're all about sharing the love of fitness, and your support fuels that mission. So grab your water bottles, tie up those laces, and let's dive into the world of muscle building. Ever heard of the push pull and legs routine? It's a workout split that harnesses the power of three fundamental movements, pushing, pulling, and leg exercises. Push exercises involve movements that require pushing away from the body. This targets the chest, shoulders, and triceps, building strength and definition. Then we have pull exercises, which involve movements that pull towards the body. These exercises primarily work the back and biceps, helping to sculpt a strong upper body. And finally, leg exercises target the lower body, including the quadriceps, glutes, hamstrings, and calves. It's a complete workout that targets every major muscle group in the body. This simple yet effective approach is a game changer for muscle building. Let's find out why. Why is the push, pull, and leg split the best for muscle fast? You might be wondering. Well, there are several compelling reasons. Firstly, it promotes balanced training. The split ensures all major muscle groups get the attention they deserve, eliminating the risk of overdeveloping certain areas while neglecting others. Secondly, it allows for optimal muscle recovery. By focusing on different muscle groups each day, you give the others a chance to rest and repair, which is crucial for muscle growth. Thirdly, it offers flexibility. You can adjust the sequence depending on your schedule and energy levels. Finally, it's efficient. This split targets all major muscle groups effectively, which means you're not wasting any time in the gym. In a nutshell, the push, pull, and leg split is a comprehensive, adaptable, and efficient approach to muscle building. So, are you ready to give it a shot? Now that we know why this split is superior, let's explore how to create a killer push day. Ready to push your limits? Today, we're diving into the nitty-gritty of creating your push day. Our focus here is threefold, chest, shoulders, and triceps. These muscle groups work in unison during push movements, and an effective push day routine will target all three. Let's kick things off with the chest. I'm talking about exercises like bench presses, incline presses, and flies. These are your bread and butter for developing a broad and powerful chest. Remember, it's not about lifting the heaviest weights but rather engaging your muscles and maintaining proper form. Next up, shoulders. Exercises like overhead presses and lateral raises are your best bet here. They'll help shape your shoulders, giving you that coveted V-shaped physique. Key tip, don't neglect your rear delts. They're often overlooked, but they play a crucial role in shoulder health and aesthetics. Finally, we have the triceps. Close grip bench presses, tricep pushdowns, and overhead extensions will get those arms popping. Here's a pro tip, slow down your reps. By focusing on the eccentric or lowering phase, you'll stimulate more muscle growth. So there you have it, a well-rounded push day. Remember, the goal is to challenge your muscles, not to exhaust them. Listen to your body, maintain proper form, and adjust your weights accordingly. That's your push day sorted. Now, let's pull it all together. Time to pull up your socks. Now let's delve into the art of creating a successful pull day. This is the day we focus on strengthening and sculpting our back and biceps, two muscle groups that are vital for a balanced physique and functional strength. First, let's talk about the back. The back is a broad muscle group with a lot of moving parts. It's important to engage all of them to get the most out of your pull day. Deadlifts, for instance, are a great compound exercise working multiple muscles at once. Pull-ups and rows, on the other hand, can help target specific areas for a more focused approach. Now, on to the biceps. These are the muscles that pop when you flex, the ones that make you feel like a real-life superhero. Some of the best exercises for biceps are curls. You've got your barbell curls, your dumbbell curls, and your hammer curls. Each targets the biceps in a slightly different way, helping to build well-rounded muscle. But remember, it's not just about the exercises. It's about the approach. Progressive overload is key. This means gradually increasing the weight, reps, or intensity of your workouts over time. It's this challenge that sparks muscle growth. And don't forget to give yourself plenty of rest between sets. This allows your muscles to recover and prepares them for the next set. With the pull day in your routine, you're halfway there. Next, we tackle the leg day. Never skip leg day, a phrase that echoes in gyms worldwide. But what does a good leg day look like? Let's dive in. First, we focus on the quads, the front of your thighs. 
Exercises like squats and lunges are your best friends here. They are compound movements, meaning they work multiple muscle groups at once, giving you more bang for your buck. Remember to keep your back straight and push through your heels to really engage those quads. Next, let's talk about glutes, or as some like to call it, the powerhouse of the body. Hip thrusts and deadlifts are key exercises for targeting this muscle group. When performing these, think about squeezing your glutes at the top of the movement to get the maximum benefit. Moving on to the hamstrings, the muscles at the back of your thighs, leg curls and stiff-legged deadlifts can help isolate and strengthen these muscles. Be mindful of your form and try not to rush these exercises. Finally, we target the calves. While they may be small, they play a big role in the overall look and functionality of your legs. Calf raises are a simple yet effective exercise for this muscle group. You can perform these standing or seated. Just make sure you're feeling the burn in the right place. That covers your leg day. But we're not done yet. Let's talk about the extra mile. Abs and forearms. Want to add some extra fire to your routine? Well, let's talk about incorporating those abs and forearms into your split. This is all about adding the finishing touches that will set your physique apart. Starting with the abs, remember, these are muscles like any other. They need to be worked and rested. Try to hit them two to three times a week. Planks, leg raises, or Russian twists are great options. These movements target different areas of the abs, giving you that defined look we all strive for. Now onto the forearms, often overlooked, but oh so important. A strong grip isn't just for opening stubborn jars, it helps with virtually every upper body movement. To build those Popeye forearms, try incorporating wrist curls, reverse wrist curls, and farmer's walks into your routine. Do these a couple of times a week and you'll notice a difference not just in your grip strength, but in the overall aesthetic of your arms. Remember, consistency is key. It might be tempting to overwork these areas, but less is sometimes more. Overtraining can lead to injuries and setbacks. Be patient, stick with it, and the results will come. And here's a pro tip. When working your abs and forearms, focus on the muscle-mind connection. Feel each contraction and release. This can really help to maximize your results, and that's how you add the finishing touches to your routine. Next time you hit the gym, give these tips a try and watch your physique reach a whole new level. That's a wrap on the push, pull, and legs routine. We've delved into the power of this split, dissecting each day from push to pull to legs and even sprinkled in some abs and forearms. This routine is a powerhouse for gaining muscle fast, efficiently working your body to its full potential. It's a fantastic strategy that combines variety, intensity, and balance. Remember, consistency is key. Now go out there and conquer your fitness goals.